We all know how important earplugs are, and this is a set of earplugs I have here, for DJs, especially if you are someone who plays in a loud club environment a lot, because you can't often control the volume in clubs, and we all know that tinnitus and even hearing loss are the unfortunate results of not paying attention to your hearing. So if you've got any um, designs on DJing regularly in very loud places for any length of time, earplugs are a must. So what I have here, is a new type of earplug, which builds on an old type, which are the type we've always recommended here at Digital DJ Tips to our students. So there's two types of earplugs that you can get. There are the kind of foam ones that you roll up and stick in your ear and you buy them in chemists and you can get a packet of 20 of them for you know a couple of dollars or whatever. They're no good because they cut out everything. It just all goes muffled. The world goes muffled. It's great if you just want to cut out everything. Not so good if you're DJing. What you really want if you're DJing is earplugs that you can pop in and then you can wear them for the whole night, put your headphones on over them and off and all that stuff. They just make everything quieter. So these are called musician's earplugs. And the way they work is they have a hole through the middle of them. So it's just making your ear canal narrower and of course the narrower the ear canal is the less sound can get in but the sound that does get in is every frequency from the highest to the lowest so it's just attenuating the volume it's making it quieter but at the same time you're hearing everything they all take some getting used to but that second type they're called musicians earplugs are the ones that you have to use if you are DJing. Now this company, Minuendo, has come up with something that we think is pretty cool. So let's take a closer look at what they've done. They have taken that idea and turned it into the kind of clever idea that the more you think about it, the more it makes sense and you think, why didn't someone do this before? They've put a volume control on the earpiece so that the hole that is open or closed depends upon where you have that so-called volume control set. So to be clear, there's no batteries in these, they're a mechanical device, but they have a little lever on them that opens or closes the hole in the earpiece, and it's this little lever here, so that the volume that you hear gets louder and quieter, depending upon where it's set. Now this kind of headphone earpiece rather, I don't know what you call them, I guess you still call them earbuds or earplugs. Earplugs is the correct word for them, of course it is. This kind of earplug, uh, it relies on something that's really important to point out, which is it relies on a really close fit. So what they've done is, you know, there's all kinds of ear protection, silicone, rubber, types of, um, of fitting for earplugs, for, for earplugs. So if you've ever bought, you know, I've got a pair of Apple uh, AirPod Pro earphones and I like to use them for running uh, and I've had to buy silicone pads to put on them and push them in and stuff and we're all used to, I think anyone who's used ear earphones or, or earplugs or AirPods or whatever is used to finding the right fit, right? And you can go on Amazon, you can buy third party bits that clip over your ear plug or your earphone or whatever it is you're using to fit your ear properly. It's a very, very personal choice. Some people prefer this type the kind of three-way type, and you've got six types here of the three-way type, you know, this kind of ear protection. Other people prefer the kind of silicone type like this. Other people prefer the big floppy ones. This is the kind of ones you get with your Apple devices. But guess what? They give you three sizes of every type you can imagine to fit onto these. So the idea is that you fit onto these, the one that works for you. In this case, I've been using these little ones here, for instance. Uh, you fit them on uh, and then you slip them in your ears and, you, and you, you experiment to find the ones which will block out the sound uh, unless you've got the volume control open here, the little bit open here. And that's literally making this hole down the middle smaller or bigger. Uh, and that's it. They're mechanical, they're simple. They're the kind of idea that, as I say, you think, why didn't someone think of this before? But it's come to these people to do it. Now, you get a little uh, zip, a little zip holder with them. And uh, this little zip holder has got one of those carrying straps that you can put around your neck uh, and also a little cleaner for them. Uh, so you've got these, these bits and pieces here as well. So they're quite uh, thoughtful in all the bits and pieces they provide for you. There's also a leaflet that details all the uh, fitting and also the attenuation you can expect and so on from them. So they've thought this through. Uh, and if you are someone who wears musicians earplugs but would like to be able to control sometimes the amount of audio getting in and out, 
there's only one brand that's doing it as far as I know and it's Minuendo and that is the uh, Minuendo lossless earplugs that we've been looking at today. We've given you a link to our full review of them underneath where you'll also find a link to uh, where you can get them from. They're pretty cool. Uh, obviously we've tried them. I've used them uh, in my gig which is why you can see that I've got a couple of the buds uh, off um, and they they did the job they did exactly what my normal musicians earplugs do but I had that control uh, honestly I think you'll probably find where you like to set them for particular venues and particular volume levels and you'll leave it but it's always good to know that if you turn up at a different venue uh, and it's louder or quieter or you go to a concert uh, or, or you just want to pop them in on a plane and shut everything out uh, while you sleep. You've got all these different settings that you can use. Uh, so the Minuendo lossless earplugs, I hope you've enjoyed this little review of them. See you again soon. Get good, get out there and make the moments. This has been Phil at Digital DJ Tips.